Hi, I'm Josie, this is Charlie, and this is Ricky. We're from Belgium, and you're watching the Philip DeFranco Show. Mm. Mm. This is a new show. I lied, you're not really watching the Philip DeFranco Show. You could be, though, if Phil decides to use my intro. So, so if you want to help persuade Phil to use my intro in one of his videos, that would be really cool. We can just comment on one of his videos asking if he could please, please use my intro. Um, or you could try making your own and sending that to Phil. I think that's a nice idea. I've been a, a long-time fan of Sexy Phil's, and he's part of the reason why I started my own YouTube channel. I started out doing strange and funny news items, and I will, I will do a news video soon, because some of you have been asking about that. But he's part of the reason why I started, and it would be cool if I could appear in one of his videos. That would be... That would be pretty awesome. I hope you guys are doing really well. I just quickly wanted to say that if you want to find out who won the thanks hoodie, you should go to the thanks YouTube channel, the link in the description box below, where they announce the winner of the hoodie. Uh, also, Taylor's Therapeutic is the one who won the LOL bracelet. Taylor, please keep an eye on your YouTube inbox. I'll be sending you a message to ask for your contact info. Also, I wanted to add a little disclaimer about that video, the thanks video. Some people didn't seem to understand um, the intent. I was not sponsored by Thanks in any way. I just thought it was a cool initiative and I wanted to sort of promote that. And I think it's sad that a lot of YouTubers can't promote things that they support or appreciate without being called, you know, a sellout or without people thinking that they have ulterior motives or thinking that they're sponsored or paid in any way. So I just wanted to make clear that that was not at all the case. I just thought it was a cool initiative and I thought it was nice to sort of show appreciation. Um, so a little disclaimer, I hope that sort of clears up um, all the doubt you may have had. I hope you guys are doing well, I just quickly wanted to say hello, show how Ricky and Charlie are getting along, they're getting along great, and they play fight all the time, and it seems really violent from afar, but they both seem to love it and they keep doing it. So it's, it's really weird, they love each other, they sleep together and everything, it's kind of strange. Um, but Charlie has also made another friend, he's befriended a stray cat. We've named the other cat Woodstock. We figured that really went well together. Um, they have a play date every night, and so we started feeding the stray cat also, because it's kind of sad to, to see him be so alone. So they play every night. He's still a bit scared of humans. Maybe we can get him to come in and sleep here at night also, because I think it's going to get really cold for him out there. Um, but he looks really cute, and they look really cute together. I also quickly wanted to thank Jonathan for sending me this lovely play by Aaron Sorkin. It's called The Farnsworth Invention. It's really cool. I'm trying to read it really slowly because I don't want it to end. But when I finish it, I'll, I'll try and do a little book review if you guys would like that. Um, it's really cool. It's absolutely brilliant. I recommend it even though I haven't finished it already. But it's Sorkin, so it's, it's totally brilliant. Alright, that's it. I hope you guys have a great weekend, and I'll see you soon. Peace out. Oh yay! End screen! End screen! Oh, why am I excited? It's the end of the video, I should be sad. End screen. That's okay, don't be sad. There's other videos that you can watch, like my previous video, if you haven't seen that already. It's a parody of the One Million commercial by Paco Rabanne, and it's sort of a mix of One Million and the Make Poverty History campaign that happened a long time ago with all those celebs snapping their fingers. Um, so I tried to mix that up because I thought it was a little bit decadent that they overlap. Also, if you click my face, you can go to a random video. Because um, randomness can be fun too, right? Now I have to stay still so you can click my face. Uh oh, uh oh, I'm moving, uh oh. Alright, so that's it for today. I hope you guys are doing well. Please click my face or the One Million parody. Either one. Or both. You can click both. That's a great idea. Let's do that.